I'm excited about this financial management curriculum because it's going to empower grantees to understand what's required. They're going to know um, definitively from a subject by subject area exactly what the requirements are from a federal government perspective, from a HUD perspective, and from a programmatic perspective as well. A well-organized financial management system can make our grantees much more efficient by reducing the amount of administrative burden and allowing our grantees to spend more time administering the programs and making a difference in people's lives, which they want to do. If you don't have good financial management, what happens is you tend to deviate from what HUD would like you to do and what the rules are, so then you jeopardize your program. So good financial management keeps you in line with what needs to be done and what HUD would like to see and the right thing to do for your, for your programs. And ultimately, at the end of the day, it allows us to provide more programs to the individuals in our communities that need them the most at the times when they need them the most. In addition, I think it gives the funding agencies, the federal agencies and other um, recipients, confidence in the ability to administer the grant programs um, as well as to demonstrate compliance. Through good financial management, our, our grantees, particularly the ones that are uh, really excel and are doing a great job and we look at them as best practices, have good financial management controls. And so by having those good financial management controls, they are able to really spend more time administering the programs as they are intended. If someone is doing well and it's in good shape, then they don't, you may just require them to report once every three months. But if things are not in order, you will be needing them to do it every month, sometimes maybe even more than that, because you need to be sure that they get in compliance. The advantage um, that um, Work Express has in keeping the records straight the first time is that we're able to monitor them more easily. They'll spend more time on the program delivering the program that they have requested funds for, which is to provide jobs and job training for homeless folks. When we have strong financial management policies in place, it allows us to leverage even more money, which is such a crucial element, especially when programs are being cut. It makes it that much more important that we leverage additional resources to provide these programs. If there's good financial management, you know, at, at the subrecipient level, then this will show that they're succeeding, and this will also show that um, they know how to handle funds no matter how small they are. I think for a new person starting out in financial management, it's most important to arm yourself with what the actual regulations and requirements are. Um, this curriculum will be able to do that in a way that not only just is uh, regurgitating what the regulations are, but in an applied manner that helps you understand how it fits into your job, both from a programmatic perspective and from a financial management perspective. To all of you that are new to financial management, I say be not afraid because we've got this great curriculum, we've got great staff at the federal level, and we've got lots of tra online trainings.